Happy Chicken Day, everybody. Oh. Or whatever this is. Aw, now Chicky can finally live up to his ancestors and look just adorable while doing it. <laughs> what a cute little nugget. In fact, it looks like all the animals are having a costume party today. Oh. A dog dryer. Let's hope today's toys are all about our furry friends. But first, let's make sure it actually works. Thank goodness we already have a wet puppy. What a good girl, staying calm while putting something on her. Let's hope she stays nice when the dryer turns on. Well, if you ever wanted a puppy puppy, here you go. Wow, it works. And while you're here, why don't you subscribe? Anything that makes balloon dogs is worth its weight in gold. A dog umbrella? Wait, how is she going to be able to hold that handle? Something tells me that chain is going to answer that. Right, the hook keeps the umbrella close by while you hold it. Good thing, too. It looks like a real storm out there. And there's even room for two. But the important thing is that the dog's okay. I guess this is a tool that you and your furry friend can share. Yeah, relax those smile muscles. Seriously, she smiles way too much. But let's try it out on your cat. Wow, he seems to like it. You've got yourself a real Cheshire cat here, don't you? I wonder if it works on pets other than cats. <laughs> let's see. This thing seems to be a real crowd pleaser, doesn't it? From this angle, this thing almost looks like a face. With this pouch, now you can always keep your best buddy close by. After all, why should kangaroos have all the fun? They've had it good for too long. Make sure to zip everything up. How on earth did she get that jacket on underneath? Aww, now you can take your dog on bike rides through the park? Keep him close while doing your laundry and other chores. And even introduce them to various babies. I mean, you probably can do that without a pouch, but where's the fun in that? That lady's just jealous that you have a cuter baby. What makes this cat toy more interactive than regular cat toys? Well, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Oh, wow! Huh, it moves on its own. All the fun of playing with your cat without actually playing with your cat. Hmm. Or the fun. Yeah, in other words, some cats just have good taste. I wonder if we're gonna see anything for that baby chick. A duck muzzle? For your dog? I guess that's close enough. Okay, I see. This way, your pupper doesn't sneak snacks without you knowing. Especially any suspicious breadcrumbs. Yeah, that's right, I read Hansel and Gretel. And your puppy's already got a Halloween costume, too. Of course, dog care is a little more than just fun and games. Being a responsible pet owner can be real dirty work. In other words, honey, that's not a purse. Well, get your bag ready. It's time for a walk. Oh, man. I don't want to know what you've been feeding this dog. Good idea. Use the tool. You don't know where this toy's been. And you can throw it away without getting your hands dirty. Hey, don't tell me what I can and can't use for a purse. Well, whatever this is, I'm having flashbacks to my pet hedgehog. Which is weird, considering I've never had a pet hedgehog. Aside from Sonic, that is. Either way, it's a paw cleaner, and it looks like you need to put it together. Complete with some water and a lid. Make it tight. And it looks like we already have some dirty paws to try it on. She's caught red-handed. Or maybe uh, brownish-gray-handed. Three, two, one. Success! Her paw is nice and clean. But don't forget, she's got four paws. Make sure to really get in there. And we've also got a nifty tool for cleaning those paw prints on the floor. A mop. 
This thing looks like a gadget from an old-timey sci-fi movie. Please tell me you're not feeding candies to your dog. Okay, good idea. Try it for yourself before testing it on your dog. I mean, I wouldn't want something happening to the dog. Good thing your dog's such a good girl. It's always time for a treat. Wow, that's a good catch. Did she do it a second time? Yes! Third time's a charm. Make that fourth. Good girl. No one cares about the fifth. That'd just be excessive. Yeah, a dog deserves a nice treat after a good workout. What's this? Oh, it's a brush for doggy bath time. Only now, we just need a magic tool to get your dog in the tub. Oh, that's clever. You even get to sneak in the soap. And every second counts once your puppy hits the water. Wow, either you have the most well-behaved dog on earth or your pet fish is in serious need of a haircut. But seriously, how do you do it? Extra walk, double kibble? Don't forget the towel. We don't want her to shake herself dry. Although I'm surprised such a good girl doesn't towel herself off. If only everybody else was so easy to train. By the way, who gets to tell them that's the dogs? What's next? A tennis ball? <laughs> Come on, that's an old classic. Now that's more like it. Adding a techno twist. <laughs> oh, uh, not that kind of techno. Either way, she seems to be having a good time. If only they made something that puts the balls in for you. Cool. With this next tool, we get to play doggy dentist. By the way, have you subscribed already? Come on, even your dog wants you to do that. Hey, bad girl, that's the dogs. I really need to keep an eye on her. That's better. And by the looks of things, or rather, the smell. We picked the right time to try it out. If only she'd open her mouth. Don't forget to hold her still. I should have spoke sooner. There's a reason they invented dental chews. Those toys were doggone awesome. Catch you next time. Cute little wiener pup. And they blow up so fast, don't they? Still, this pupper could use some fur. Now she's a real dog. Thank you, Blue Fairy. And she's got a surprise. More puppies are on the way. Good thing she went to vet school. Cause it's time for a sonogram. Oh look, someone's having triplets. Which means you're eating for four now. Well, that just proves my point. Good thing we've got our handy dandy pooper scooper. Just look at that face. He's so happy to help. Oh, me so full. But me could always eat one more. Puppy owners need to keep up their strength, too. And if she can get a treat, too, she won't complain. Though you're kind of getting a little messy. Don't worry. This hula hoop will help. Of course, a little water's just common sense. Let's dry you off. And just in time for a little <laughs> costume change. Sometimes you just need a random dance break. 
but we could do without all this hair. Some durian fruit should help. Slice in half. And add some hot glue. And stick to the wall. Now it's a makeshift scratching post. One that will keep all that hair in one place. Of course, we want puppies to have a little fur. Oh no! And you didn't even overwater it! It's simple. Our pup needs a secret garden all her own. Ooh, let's add treats our dog will appreciate. Eh, maybe make sure they get in the hole. Come on, girl. It's time to look for buried treasure. And maybe you should try trimming that. Uh-oh. Someone got into some paint. Still, these are some nice paw prints. Cut them out and shrink them in the oven. Now that's what I call puppy size. And they're your collar's crowning glory. Ooh, are the sheep visiting? Wait, no, someone's teething. Don't worry, we'll give you something to chew on. Stuff up some tights. And we mean plural. Now staple them up together. Well, this should give us a hand. You know, there's always time for a manicure. And now, you've got the best seat in the house. Hot dog. That is one big sausage. You know, bread's not the only thing that can be a soup bowl. Besides, she likes her ramen to have extra meat. And there's plenty to go around. Okay, we really need to start cleaning under here more often. Or at least keep better track of our tennis balls. With a little needling, keep them on a string. <laughs> In fact, this works for all sorts of things. Hang them up. It's like a party in a cube. Of course, all good parties need snacks. Now for the big unveiling. It's like a puppy playroom. The piece de resistance. The tennis ball. Oh, she's gonna sleep good tonight. Silly puppy, that's for drinking. Uh, sort of. Good thing it comes in fun size. Press the button and fill her up. Have a drink. And when you're done, how about some TP? Ooh, a watermelon. Let's slice it up. Well, that's one way to do it. Still, we'll need a few more cuts. Now it's time to scoop out the good stuff. But first, we're gonna need the rind. With some eyes and ears, it's a puppy! Hmm. As for the red stuff, let's get out the cookie cutter and make some fun shapes. With all these animals, it's our very own zoo. Now, one for me, one for you. It's selfie time. Well, that's not going on the fridge. Don't worry, 
All you need is some handy dandy cardboard. Time to put those art classes to work. All that green can only mean one thing. It's a dinosaur. Well, almost. We still need a head, and we've got just the right one. Perfect. You can be anything. The limits your imagination. Sometimes puppies need help communicating. But all you need are just a few buttons. Now your dog can let you know what it needs. Whether it's playtime or just a drink or even a little pampering. After all, it's hard work being this cute all the time. Now it's time for a massage. Or, as she calls it, a belly rub. Well, I guess your photo needs a new frame. Better yet, let's get a document folder. Now you can finally give your photos an outline, like you're in your very own cartoon. Huh, that's an idea. We'll just need a projector. Tape it on. Add some light. And enjoy the show. This is just what the wall needs. Go grab some paint. And put those tracing skills to work. A pacifier? Oh, that gives me an idea. Hmm. It just needs another cut. And we can add a Scooby snack inside. Let's add a decoration while we're at it. Aww. Now she's giving us a smile. Is anyone else feeling dizzy? Oh, it's laundry day. Hmm. I guess those jeans were dry clean only. Well, at least we know someone they'll fit. Something tells me this happens a lot on laundry day. Well, now they're two of a kind. Well, it looks like we've just stumbled upon the mysterious city of boxes. Hey, sup, kitty? How's it purring? Yeah, these cats sure know how to party. Resting up for a big day of sleeping. Geez, I wonder how they got those posters in there. Oh, look. There's a pair of little dog boots and balloons. Good. They look like a perfect fit. Perfect for a winter workout. Keeps those little paws mess-free. And looks cute while doing it. Let's try the other one. Cut off the rim of a balloon and add it on. And look. After a walk, the balloon shoes are just as durable. Wow, a donut and a ladle. I wonder what they do. No, wait, that's not a real... Yeah. Well, if you can't eat it, wear it. And it protects your pup from getting lost. Now, how about the other one? A nice big ladle can work just as well. And the best part is, your dog can also help you serve soup. Ah, looks like more things for your pet to wear. But this time, we're going with cats. Make sure Mr. Kitty is nice and secure. Zip up that zipper. Wow. Now your 
cat can get lost in a good book as you hold it for them. Hmm. Okay, our plan B is gonna be wearing this shirt like a pouch. In you go. Now he's got a nice place to relax as you prepare him snacks. Two different brushes for your cat because cats deserve nice things. It even catches and releases all that excess fur. <laughs> now it's a wig. Oh, we're gonna add some special touches to this brush. Cool. It's like you made a little homespun scratching post. Oh, you gotta love that the cat does its own brushing. But all that hair? A licking mat? Oh, and it looks like hanging it up is a breeze. Wow, this should also make bath time a lot easier than usual. Maybe the plastic wrap will work too. Even if it goes on your head? Well, this should keep those aliens from reading your thoughts. Oh, good boy. Doggo stays still during a bath and a manicure. That's a whole spa day. A collar that lights up. Now that is a real fashion statement. This'll really step up your dog's laser tag game. And of course, making him easy to spot in the dark. Then again, we can always make this out of glow sticks. Just keep adding them on. And make sure that they fit, and hopefully last a while. And just like that, your pooch is ready for a rave. Our pets have spent a full day of pampering, so let's keep pampering them! It's like your cat has a bunch of tiny hands with tiny fingers all at his disposal. Toothbrushes will save on batteries, but the important thing is that the cat's happy. Good idea. But a cat can't spend all day being spoiled. It needs some playtime. What cute little mice. And cool, they come in a lot of colors. Makes you wish that real mice were this fun to play with. But as we all know, a cat's favorite toy is the box it came in. Especially when you get to play with it together. Aww. Oh, good. Now our canine friends get to join in on the fun. And with tasty treats. Come on, puppy, put your nose to work and find those goodies. Seems like fun, but can we repeat this game with a towel? Just lay the kibble on the towel and then roll it up, like sushi. Seems to work just as well, but you're not sticking the toy in the laundry.
Of course, after a treat, your dog needs something to wash it down with. Normally, you shouldn't put water in flowers. It's not nice. But this seems a lot nicer. We made ourselves a fountain. Cool. And would you look at that. He likes it. But can a water bottle be more than enough? Let's try it out. Well, as long as it's secured to the wall. Either way, your puppy gets a nice drink. Yeah, petrific stuff. And thanks to our furry friends who helped out with this video. Catch you next time. You know, this Cheetos can put some pep in your step. Oops. Just built a little boot around it. Add some paint, or even better, glitter chair. And you've got new lifts. Now get stepping. On second thought, watch your step. You got paw prints everywhere, don't worry. Enough caramel can cover up any blemish. Give it time to harden and you've got candy. Add a stick and it's a lollipop. Or should we say lollipop? Done with that bottle? Good, we can recycle it. Especially that cap. Add clay and a paper dog. This ain't construction paper. Color them in. For the eyes, let's go with googly. The gang's all here. Let's get rocking. They just keep going and going and going. <laughs> Wow, a dog making dumplings. Eh, still better than mine. Don't worry, that's what our dumpling maker's for. All you need's the dough and filling and voila. You've got a perfectly wrapped dumpling. Wow. Careful, that might be the one with kibble. Ooh, a bone! Ooh, an even bigger bone. And ooh, a corgi? Kind of breaking the pattern. But at least he seems fun to play with. Give him a treat and watch what comes out. Ooh, careful where you're aiming that. Oh no, not the cheese puffs. I wouldn't eat that. Ew, someone get this dog a diaper. Wow, a candy machine. Looks like you've caught one. This game's a lot of fun for kids. But as for pups, not so much. But maybe then can join in on the fun. We can make our own candy machine. Just with kibble instead of candy. Press a button and the treats come pouring in. It's good thing his head fits in. Hmm, I guess someone ran out of candy. Oh, 
Oh, no. Monica's missing. Oh, there she is. So, does this mean I get the reward? Guys, I'll get back to you. For now, let's get crafty. Next time she gets lost, she'll have an ID tag. We'll need her name and a contact number. It's kind of big. Let's shrink it down to size. Bake it in the over and bam, it's bite-sized. Just the right size to fit around her neck. <laughs> it's lunchtime. Guess someone doesn't want to share. I know, grab a pop tube and a funnel. And let the food come right to you. Use a bowl to keep everything in one place. Unless, of course, you want to eat off the floor. All done? Well, let's keep it around for dinner. I heard of dog groomers, but not like this. Oh no, you took off the whole eyebrow. It's okay, this toy has plenty of hair to share. He just keeps it in his blackheads. Good. It should be more than enough. But first, he really needs a shave. This is going to take a lot of shaving cream. Time for a rinse. And that's good enough. What a good boy. You've earned a treat. Ooh, a hot dog. The last food in the house. I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. It's simple solution. Just split it up. You get a piece and so do you. Hey, what about me? Mmm, pizza. Wait, watch out. Oh, no. Is the pizza okay? We can rebuild it. Fry up the dough. Okay, this might take a while. Good. This face is nice and crispy. But a little makeup wouldn't hurt. No one wakes up looking their best. Take a bite. Just eat around the eyelashes. Oh no, your wig. I told you to tape it down. Don't worry, we'll make you some new hair. Cut up something purple, like onions. Just as long as she looks like an anime character. Start by whipping them up into spirals. Anyone else starting to tear up? Just me? Let's lie her down and see if we have enough. Let's save some too. I want onion rings. That should be enough. Looking good. Wow. So where are we on those onion rings? <laughs> Oh, even the tiniest of hearts can be broken. But don't worry, we'll make you a new friend. Literally, just need a glove, a cup, and some markers. Give it a muzzle, and soon you've got a brand new dog. Tuck it inside. Add a hole and a straw and blow it up. She's ready. Time for a meet cute. Emphasis on cute. Wow, they really like hot dogs around here. The chase begins. Get back here. Okay, now I'm starting to get dizzy. Hey, don't give up. 
Get crafty. Or better yet, crafting. Draw a runner in one circle and their legs in another. Cut off the tip of a straw to connect them together. Now these paper dolls will do all the running for you. Add a background and it's like you're in a cartoon. So who won? Hey, let's call it a draw. Ooh, what's in that giant block shaped box? Oh, that little shirt's sure seen better days. We can spruce it up. Get out those felt tip markers. And I mean all of them. Make a rainbow. Roll it up and add to water for a nice, relaxing soak. Once it dries, help your furry friend become fashion forward. Careful with those paws. Don't you look cute? Well, cuter. And since you're all dressed up, let's dance. Shake that tail. <laughs>